There was a Wild Hogs too, wasn't there? There was. There had to be. Am I crazy? No, you're not crazy because I I remember why Disney thing. canceled the sequel. <gasps> so there was a sequel there and Disney was... canceled it. Those cowards at Disney. Wild Hogs also beat David Fincher's acclaimed thriller Zodiac at the box office. <laughs> Came as a little surprise when Wild Hogs 2 Bachelor Ride was announced soon after, which would reunite the cast and director Walt Becker for another wacky misadventure. Ew. They dropped it in 09. Oh, that sucks. We never got one. I don't Wild know why Hugs. I said that sucks. <laughs> no, it sucks because it's something we can't make fun of because it doesn't exist. We can only dream about what it would have been like. I know. Or what it might be like. Bachelor ride? Who's getting hitched? Yeah, who's the bachelor in this movie? Because they're all married. Well, William yeah. H. Macy... Maybe not. I think he was like a divorcee. Well, yeah, he found love in that town that they defended from those real bad bikers that John Travolta fucked with when they ran out of gas on the open road. And he goes into uh, a biker bar trying to act like he's one of them. And then they're like, you're not a real biker. You're just a fucking lame dad. And then he gets all mad and, and blows up the bar. That's not a joke. Because he's secretly Nicolas Cage. And this is a face-off crossover. Oh, that would be the best. If Wild Hogs 2 See, that would be Wild Hogs 2 because was a face. Yeah. Yes. Fa is Wild Hogs 2 is all just face-off All our face faces got mixed up. <laughs> we got a ride... Oh my god! To get him back, and Alec Baldwin can finally play a black man. <sighs> Not Al why do I keep saying Alec Baldwin? John Travolta. I don't know. Can finally play a black man because you, you know Alec they Bald would swap Martin Lawrence and yeah. and John Travolta because then John John Travolta can finally be like, "Damn motherfucker, why are you doing this?" <laughs> and Martin Lawrence like just because you have my face, uh, it, <laughs> it it doesn't fit. There's no like, please don't, <laughs> please no. One note, uh, <laughs> please don't do that. One note, please, Mr. Travolta. Don't. <laughs> Man. Yeah. Born to be mild is a lot better. I swear that was probably a, that had to be a tagline. If that, point. if that was not in the writer's room, then like, I have no pity on where their careers went after that. Easy cheese writer. Oh, easy cheese writer. Uh, what's another one? I know I'm trying to think of motorcycle movies. Uh, uh, there's got to be like a, a hell. Is there like a Hellraiser? Born to raise hell. Parentheses before nine p.m. Yes, yes. Something along those lines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Born, born to raise hell before our wives come home. Oh boy, if our wives will let us. <laughs> <laughs> Marriage is slavery. We are, every comedian knows that. Uh, what's another one? These are fun. Um, <laughs> this is the show now. This is the show now. It's just wild hogs. <laughs> Taglines that never were. Uh, wild hogs. Um, squeal like a pig. <laughs> wild hogs. Guys, we can't all ride in the sidecar. Someone actually has to ride a motorcycle. <laughs> Uh, wild hogs. Uh, the open road. Uh, oh, oh yeah, yeah. The the road is only open on weekends. <laughs> wild hogs. The next place we stop, can they see if they have Wi Fi? There's there's a few emails I need to respond to before end of day. Uh, wild hogs. Where. The bikes are loud and the jackets don't quite fit right. All right, that's enough. All right. Yes, enough.